Hello, everybody, and welcome to first question and answer of our uh, Toronto French Open. I'm very glad to be with you guys, and uh, thank you all coaches, players, uh, supporters, uh, or officials, and um, the team behind the scene helping us to make this competition be happening. So today, I thought with me, uh, our uh, technical delegate, uh, Grandmaster, uh, Mustafa is with me today and uh, with uh, yeah. very experienced referees from all around the world. I will see if I can remember. So I have got from uh, one of the very, my good friend, Master Peter from Austria. I have got uh, Master Pablo from Spain. I have got Grandmaster Konstantin from Germany and uh, Grandmaster Hafez from Iran. We have got our uh, Ross uh, IT uh, technician Sabin from Latvia. We have got Master Lavan uh, from Sweden. And I have got Master Carolina from Pumsi Channel and UK is with me. And I have Master Barbara with us today and Grandmaster Johanna from Austria today with me. Okay, so before we go through the presentation from Grandmaster uh, Chris, uh, from Belgium, uh, first I would like to introduce uh, our very experienced referee. They will speak with you for a few minutes and then we go to the master Chris for his presentation and first of all, a uh, question and answer if you have anything. Okay, I'll start with our technical delegate, Grand Master Mustafa, sir. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Mr. Kambis Ali. Uh, actually, I'm happy to be part of this uh, big championship and uh, with, uh, yeah, also Grandmaster uh, uh, Chris and also I saw um, uh, very experienced uh, referees worldwide. Actually, I work with them during the, uh, the world, uh, world online and actually, uh, yeah, uh, everybody will do the best and also <coughs> when the athletes. Uh, I wish them uh, and good luck, prepare well, and uh, let's make uh, together this uh, Toronto Open su together success. And uh, no, good luck to everybody. Thank you very much, Grandmaster. Thank you, Grandmaster. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank, thank you. you so much, Grandmaster. Now we are going to go to Germany. We have got my very good friend, Grandmaster Constantine. So, Hey. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, my friends, my colleagues. Uh, well, it's just uh, today from my birthday party. Uh, <laughs> happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you, my friend. Let's, uh, let's, let's, start, let's start together. One, two, three. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. To you. Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Happy birthday, birthday to you. Have a nice day. Thank you, everybody. Uh, enjoy. Very I wish uh, a, a very close uh, tournament with uh, no mistake this time, and I hope we can present our best for the players. Uh, I'm sure I want to be also the same word as Grandmaster Mustafa said. Uh, there is many very experienced referees. Uh, let's make this uh, competition as a big success and uh, with no mistake and fair, fairness and transparency for all the players. I wish all us good luck and for the coaches also. Uh, please always, if you have questions, always ask because it's better to ask than to not act without uh, and do wrong things. So thank you very much, everybody. And uh, I'm very happy to be with you, one team of the member. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very thank much. You. And then I'm going to go to Austria. I have got with me in Austria, uh, Grandmaster Johanna. Yes, welcome from Austria. My name is Johanna Blim, and it is a pleasure to be in the team again. I'm very happy, and I wish you good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Grandmaster. And then 
I'm going to go to Sweden with Master Laban. Hello, everybody. I wish you good luck. And with this team, we are uh, uh, very, very, we have uh, been working together uh, all the pandemic. I know the best is going to win. We are a strong team and we uh, know how to do it. So welcome and good luck to everybody. Thank you, Grandmaster. And um, we're going now to Iran to Grandmaster Hafez Matavi. Hello, good evening, everybody. This is uh, Hafez Mahde from Iran. Uh, I think uh, uh, this tournament will be uh, very successful because we have uh, 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 more uh, experience, uh, too much experience referee. Also, the uh, WT uh, Pumse referee chair is, it will be with us, uh, uh, Grandmaster Mustafa also. Thank you for your uh, good uh, the, the, the uh, perfect technology about uh, judge scoring. And that's very good because uh, we have, uh, as you uh, everybody know, we have good experience about uh, uh, range competition and then uh, uh, combis uh, 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 did uh, very perfect organizing about uh, all uh, tournaments. Thank you, all the best for all and uh, Enjoy. Thank you very much, Grandmaster. And now we are going to go to Spain. So, Grandmaster Pablo. Hello, good evening, everyone. Um, my name is Pablo. I'm from Spain. Uh, what my colleagues have already said. Um, I hope uh, all competitors uh, enjoy the, the, the first uh, Toronto Championship. Thank you very much for the organization, the invitation, and good luck for everyone. Enjoy. Thank you very much, Master. Now we're going to go to Austria, back again to Austria. So we have got Master Peter. Hello, everyone. This is uh, Peter from Austria. Nice to have you back again here in the range series of tournaments from Master Cambis. As everyone said, it's a very good team, very experienced, so you're in good hands. Um, yeah, looking forward to meet you all and to see your performances. Thank you, enjoy. Thank you very much. And then, Master Peter, we're going now to Pumse Channel. We have got Master Carolina with us. Thank you, thank you everybody, and welcome to this uh, super nice competition. As all uh, more experienced colleagues have said, uh, this is a very well organized uh, tournament. Thank you for uh, Master Cambis and his uh, organization team. And as uh, Master Peter say, you are in good hands. Just enjoy and prepare your best performance for this competition. Thank you. Thank you very much, Master. Uh, Master Barbara's camera is not on, but she can send us the voice. Let me see. Master Barbara, can you hear me? Oh, hello. Yes, I'm here. Oh, yes. Um, hello. Um, good evening, everybody. Um, my name is Barbara. I am from the UK. I just wish to say um, welcome to everybody. Enjoy the competition. It is a well-run machine here fabulous um, international judges from around the world. Absolutely amazing, enjoy, and all the best. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Master Barbara. And then we go to Latvia to my uh, team of the um, IT scoring system and my help. So let's bring her to the spotlight. So here you go, uh, Sabine. Yeah, hello everyone. Uh, hello, Taekwondo family, referees. I'm very happy to be here again and uh, be a part of the ROS team. Uh, as you know, I'm from Latvia, so everyone can enjoy this competition. Uh, and uh, you are all are very really welcome, coaches and uh, competitors or people who just love Taekwondo. You know, we are one team and one Taekwondo. Good luck for everyone. Okay, thank you very much, Sabine. 
and then we're going to go to our um, IR director, Grandmaster Christian, and he is going to have a presentation for you guys. So uh, from now, mm -hmm. we will be with Grandmaster Chris. Grandmaster Chris. Yes, hello, everybody. Welcome to this uh, query questions and answers uh, for the Toronto Range Online 2021. Um, we have, as you saw already, a fabulous team of referees. We are very proud to have them in our team. And I'm sure the best will win. So what I'm going to do now is that I'm going to share a Word document with you with some rules, and then we'll explain it. Um, just one moment. I have to open the file. mode see what I'm showing yes 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 okay so first of all some general information we are using the cutoff system so the cutoff system it's the classical system used in Unsei tournaments it means that a bunch of players are starting starting in a certain group then there is a preliminary 50% of the competitors goes to the semifinals, and then there is again a competition, and then uh, the eight best, the top eight go to the finals. So we have three big groups. We have Dan Pooms, we have Cup Grades, and we have Family Pooms. So for the Dan and the Poom, we have a preliminary, semifinal, and final competition. For the Cup Grades, we have only preliminaries and finals. There are no semifinals. So that's very important. Also, the cup grades are um, in three different categories. We have K3, that's 10 till 7 cup. There, the form is competitor's choice. And they can repeat forms. So that is very important. So for instance, somebody who has a ninth cup and he is performing Taiguk Ilchang, he can perform it twice in the preliminaries. Imagine he, is, uh, he goes to the finals, then again, he can perform it in the finals. 4K2 is from sixth till third cup. The form is still the competitor choice, but he cannot repeat form. So it means that in the preliminaries, he has to perform two forms, two different forms. And in the finals, he has to perform also two different forms. So the four forms he's performing, they must all be different. Very important. For K1, they, are, they cannot choose. They have compulsory forms. The family category, they, there is an unlimited number of competitors, but, and that is very important, at least two generations must be present. So son with father, mother with daughter with son, with what is not allowed is only, for instance, brother and sister, because it's still the same generation. We need two different generations. They have immediately finals, and they have, they have to perform two forms, two pumse or um, two um, taiguk. It's their own choice, and it can be twice the same. That's also important to know. So the cutoff system for the Dan grades, I told you already, we have preliminary, we have semifinal and we have final. But imagine we have an, um, an, a group of competitors with only um, 20 competitors or less, then we don't have preliminary. So we have only a preliminary when we have more than 20 competitors in um, the group. 50% goes to the semifinals. In the semifinals, they compete again. Then the top eight goes to the finals. And in the finals, then they um, compete again. And then we have number one, two, three, and four. What is important is that um, imagine there are only 10 or less competitors, then or uh, boom grades, then it's immediately finals. Concerning the cup grades, if there are more than 12 competitors, 
we have preliminary. If we have less than 12 uh, competitors, we have immediately final. Remember, we don't have semifinals for the cup grades. So more than 12 competitors, the top eight go to the finals and then they compete to know which one is number one, number two, number three, and number four. How must the videos be recorded? That is very important. So you can see here in the scheme, the camera position is fixed. You cannot move the camera. It has been in the same position. The recording must be in landscape, not in portrait mode. The competitor has a starting position. The ideal distance is approximately seven meters and uh, he must face the camera. That's very important too. What about Zoom? Yeah, I'm not What about that. Zoom? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Zoom is not allowed. Yeah. Not allowed. Zoom is not allowed. Okay. Going up and down is not allowed, but, and you can see that here on this sign, going left to right is allowed. Okay. But remember the position of the camera is yes. still yes. the same, you cannot, Place the camera on a different position. Oh, yeah, yeah. But you Only go to the left or you go to the right. You can turn it. Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. Exactly. Thank you. More details can be found in the outline and in the document that's already uh, delivered earlier, coaches' guideline and rules of the competition for this uh, uh, TRO 2021. But we will um, come back on some of these things uh, more here in the hands on guidelines. There are some rules and they have nothing to do with the quality of the performance. They have nothing to do with small mistakes, big mistakes with presentation. They are all rules based on how do you have to uh, create your video um, following certain rules. So the Pumse performance can be recorded indoors or outdoors. Mats, they can, you can use a mat, but it's not uh, recommended. It's recommended, but it's uh, allowed to perform without mats. You can do it anywhere. You can do it inside, you can do it outside, you can do it in the living room. There must be no boundary lines. Also, the starting position must not be marked. But what is important is imagine the competitor is performing in the living room and there is not enough place and he must do an extra step just to perform every extra step, there will be a deduction of 0 0.3 from the accuracy. The participants must wear a uh, WT Pumse uniform or a Taekwondo Dobok, the white Taekwondo Dobox uh, from Cookie One. They must have the correct belt, but there are exceptions for color. Uh, they must have the correct belt, yes, but there are exceptions for colored belts. Because we know that the, color, the colors of the belts are not the same in the different countries. If there is something irregular, so for instance, um, there is a Poom grade, but he's wearing a black belt, there is a 0 0.6 deduction from the final score. What is not allowed also is that the participants are wearing any or socks or shoes. If they do, it's the 0 0.6 deduction from the final score. The male participants are not allowed to wear a t-shirt under the Taekwondo uniform. The female participants are allowed. The color is not important. Uh, I have um, in, the, in the previous competition, uh, here it is only written about the t-shirt, but in the previous competition, sometimes we see some uh, girls and even some uh, boys are wearing a legging under the, uh, the uniform. So it's mean here that the leggings is allowed. Legging is allowed. Yeah. Legging is allowed. And, and the team, For both? And Me, for both. Female and male? Yeah, yeah. The, okay. The yeah. T-shirt uh, for the girls, it doesn't matter which color is it. No, true, yeah. Thank you. The participants are not allowed to wear any type of jewelry. Sometimes that can be a problem. For instance, somebody is wearing an earring and it's very difficult to remove it. So the solution is to tape it, put the tape over it and then there is no deduction. 
But if the competitor is wearing any jewelry, there will be a 0 0.6 deduction from the final score. So very important not to wear jewelry. The starting position uh, must be faced toward the camera. We told that already. The video recording should be done um, horizontally, horizontal and in good quality. If you record it in portrait mode, then there is a 0 0.6 deduction from the accuracy of the first form. So please use landscape mode. What is also very important is that the participants must be all the time full body inside the screen during the Pumse performance and also including the 30 second break between uh, both forms. Also, the distance must not be too far so that the referees can clearly see which movements are done. But imagine there is part of the movement that is impossible to see or because the quality of the recording is bad or because as you can see in the picture here that the lady is kicking and the foot is outside um, the camera view, then it's a 0 0.3 deduction. If somebody re disappears completely out of the screen, it's a 0 0.6 detection, also during the break. So imagine somebody performs, then there is a break, he goes out of the view of the camera, he's coming back in the view of the camera. That means a big deduction, 0 0.6 deduction from the accuracy of the second form. Also rest time. Also rest time. Also rest time. Also, if you should be see, inside, yes. Yeah, you must always stay in the view of the camera. Mm, okay. Okay. Also Thank important. You. Imagine that somebody's head is just on yeah. top of the view, and it is a little bit. You see it, then not, then not. Every time there is a part of the head that you cannot see, it's zero yes, point yes. deduction. Okay. Thank you. As I told already, the camera must remain in the same position for the duration of the performance. You cannot zoom in, you cannot go up and down, but you can go from left to right. That is allowed. It is not allowed um, to record a video in selfie mode, in mirror mode, because then the referees see you going to the left, although you have to go to the right and vice versa. The sound recording also must be very good and it must be of good quality. So the key ups are clearly audible. If the referee cannot hear the key up, it's a 0 0.3 deduction. With Chichigi, it's not important. Imagine somebody is performing outside on the grass and he's stamping on the ground. As a judge, you cannot hear it. So we cannot make any deduction. So the rules are Chichigi. We don't uh, mind if we cannot hear it, but the key ups, they must be loud enough. We must hear them. Otherwise, zero point three detection. What also is not allowed at all is adding some sound effects to give a more powerful impression of the performance. If that happens, it's disqualification. Just be aware that when you are performing that nobody is entering. There are, it is not allowed that somebody is coming in the view or there is a pet, a dog or a cat uh, appearing uh, and disappearing. Uh, 0 0.6 deduction from a currency. Uh, uh, yes. yeah. I, will, uh, I would like to, to go to three steps backward. Uh, yeah. To the one where you write uh, the selfie video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, because it's happened the last time and we had yeah. Discussion in this case, it should be uh, 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 the minimum point. Uh, I, as I ask uh, Grandmaster Mustafa, and he uh, uh, advised me that uh, the video, if it is recorded in the mirror, it should be a minimum point in both in both both of the uh, videos. The last time we had only a deduction in the first videos. Yeah, 0 0.6 from the first um, yeah. from um, the first boom set. Yes. Yeah. According yeah. to the rule, uh, each movement uh, the player is moving is wrong. It's in the right, uh, the different direction. So every movement is wrong. When yeah. he move left, we can see only on the mirror that he move right. So uh, 
we, did, we didn't write this point. So uh, I think uh, we should add that in the uh, mirror mode, there will be a minimum point, accuracy and presentation. Uh, so what, what is your opinion? What is it's, it's a difficult one. Uh, why? because uh, every mistake related on how you record is 0 0.6 deduction from uh, the first Pumse. So if you make a mistake and you are using the selfie mode, the competitor is performing like it should be, but it's recording just uh, vice versa. And that's a problem, but he's not going to the left, he's going to the right like it should be, but it's recorded as he is going to the left. So that is a, a discussion. Um, I would say that uh, in this case, we keep the rules and then we can discuss it later for later competitions because we already published these rules. So if we, we are stick to the rules for this competition. Yeah, we stick to the rules for this competition and for the next competition, then we can see if, on, okay, we must change that. We give a zero and a 1.5 presentation. Okay, thank you. Let's hope there are not too many people. Last time there was only one. I think. Yes, yeah. only one. But yeah. yeah. I want just to be uh, clarified because uh, at that time we had the small discussion between the referee, but uh, yes. it's very difficult to see the movement. So you mm -hmm. have yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, it's very difficult to score like, or to to uh, to judge as a referee because yes. uh, it's uh, completely in mirror mode. Eh? Yes, and the the the. the, the I asked the question for Grandmaster, Grandmaster Mustafa and it mm -hmm. is his guidelines because we are using the same in the WT uh, mm -hmm. competition under the leadings of uh, Grandmaster Mustafa. And he said, uh, yes, it is completely minimum point. It means zero point in accuracy and 1.5 in presentation for both forms. So in, uh, it means the WT uh, gives a zero and 1.5. So it's. Um... Uh, I think in that case, uh, Grandmaster Mustafa is yeah. with us today. Uh, Grandmaster Mustafa, could you please? Um... Now, actually, <clears throat> in, in this situation, uh, it's not possible uh, to judge if uh, somebody uh, record is actually in the mirror. Yeah, actually, in double in double T online. I mean, the online actually um, they will. Yeah, they will actually to give uh, zero in the accuracy but uh, the mm -hmm. presentation is is a little bit different than normal 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 i, I mean the regular it will be uh, zero and 1.5 mm -hmm. but in the online uh, they will they will give uh, actually uh, yeah is disqualification because it's not according the the the, the guideline actually but uh, yeah, I see uh, yeah. that you have already uh, noticed and uh, already people know. And uh, I think it's wise for this time to follow the, this, uh, this guideline, what you have right. And uh, the next time, so you can uh, yeah. that, uh, but also Grandmaster Constantine, uh, because I asked me a few times and uh, I think it's better to to uh, to give in the accuracy uh, zero and a presentation one point five. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Thank you, sir. But, uh, yeah, because yeah, because now because the the this guideline is ready now, but if you go change, maybe people will be confusing and uh, keep this, and then the next mm -hmm. time we change. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Sir. And we will, okay. the, we will hopefully, you know, send all the information to the all the coaches uh, mm -hmm. later on tonight by email to make sure they know the rules. And most of the time, they are following the rules. And as the uh, uh, grandmaster Constantine says, last time we only had one occasion. And hopefully, every time people educate, and this kind of uh, mistake not happening. So that's the reason we are here to help them to make and make sure. Uh, yeah. are... Actually, actually, I I, I speak now to. Uh, to the coaches and the athletes. Uh, I speak now to you. 
is when you record, uh, when you record, check, check, and actually not recording and then send. Mm -hmm. uh, you record, you check, and then you upload uh, the the video of uh, the to the to the organization. This this very important. Um, you need to check before you send. And uh, normally, when you record, actually in the mirror, it's not a judge. It's it's yeah. It will yeah. be difficult for the for the referees because each movement is 0 0.3, 0 0.3, 0 0.3. Yeah? And actually in the rules, regular rules uh, said, in the accuracy, you can go down until zero. And the presentation, you can go down to 1.5. Actually in the regular. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because, uh, it will be wise before, actually I'm repeating, before you upload the video, please check. And then, Send. Thank you. Yes. Um, what I want to add on this is because I'm sure you have only selfie mode when the competitor is recording himself. So please ask somebody else to record. Then you don't need a selfie mode. Yeah. yeah. But actually, uh, uh, Grandmaster Chris, normally, normally in the online double tier online, you will be disqualified. In, in this in this case, um, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah this is no mm -hmm. discussion, but I mean, in the online uh, uh, guideline, it, it will be disqualified. What yeah. you said, right? Actually, this according, according to the online rule uh, guideline, uh, the, the 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 recording should be actually in seven meter, and the the, the camera should be fixed, and you can mm -hmm. only move your shoulder left and right. Yeah. If you uh, move actually the camera up, down, or zoom, you will be disqualified. There's, yeah. the, the, there's no discussion about this. Only yeah. be careful. Uh, I will speak now to the referees. Sometime, uh, be careful. Sometime when uh, when they record, uh, sometime you can see that the, the camera a little bit move, a little bit up, a little bit. It can happen during the, the recording, you know, uh, that the camera, but if you can see purpose that somebody during the recording zoom in, zoom out, uh, somebody record up and down purpose, is now discussion will be disqualified. I think, uh, uh, Master Mustafa, Grandmaster Mustafa, I mean, sometimes in the video they are stamping and, mm -hmm. and stamping because the camera is uh, it's standing on the floor, so it's move like fat. Mm -hmm. so yeah, 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 okay. It's a, but, it's actually, uh, yeah, actually during, during the performing sometime so far is my, my experience, uh, uh, the, the athletes, uh, make a move that some, some, that the, the floor febrilize, you know, fe you know, February that, that yep. the camera a little bit, uh, it little bit, um, shaking, uh, shaking. Yes. Thank yep. you. And it's uh, for me, for me, it's no problem. It's, uh, but if, mm -hmm. if somebody made purpose, you can see, you can see purpose, he zoom and zoom out, or he makes selfie or uh, with camera up and down. Yeah, I'm very sorry for this uh, person. But actually, I speak now to the coaches and athletes, please, please don't follow the, the guidelines. And before you upload, check, double check. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Grandmaster. So we go back okay. to Grandmaster Chris. Yes, I think we were here. It is not allowed to record both forms separately and then edit the video to merge them. That is not allowed. We want to see one video. Form one, the competitor stays in the view during the break and then form two. That's how it should be. What is also very important, and for that we count on the fair play of the competitors, is that you cannot reuse former video recordings from former competitions. That is not allowed. If we find out, it's disqualification. What is possible is that um, during the recording, um, the participants can display their identity and the national flag in the background of the video. For instance, they can show the land code, the national flag, or a club ID. They may edit the videos in a limited way, 
to display their identity, such as the name, the category, the club name, the nation of residence, and the national flag. No other form or editing is permitted. So there may not be virtual backgrounds. There may not, there may not be religious or political displays. What is encouraged is that the um, National Olympic Committee flags are um, displayed in the background. The participants may, during performance of their Taiguk of Pumse, they may wear a face mask or they may cover their face, but uh, only if, as long as their eyes and top all of, of their face is visible. If that's not the case, it's again disqualification. When the recording is finished, the participants should name the titles of their videos in the following style. Round, competitor name, category, official land code, three letters, and then TRO 2021. But those details can be found in the outline and in the document coaches guidelines and rules of competition that is delivered already early. Please, please record your videos, check them as Grandmaster Mustafa said, and then do an upload as soon as possible. And not, don't wait until the last, the last moment. Imagine there is some technical problem with your laptop, with your PC, or with the internet, and then you have a problem, and that could be a disqualification. The, all video links must be uploaded by Sunday, August the 1st, 21 hours UK time, 6 16 hours EDT time. The links received after this time, they will not be accepted and registered as disqualified. Also, be sure that the referees can see your videos. So please set public settings or, or unlist the videos. If they are private or hidden, the referees cannot see uh, the videos and then we have a disqualification. I think this was, in a nutshell, the rules that are related to online PUMSE and the online tournament of uh, Toronto. If there are any questions, shoot. Uh, thank you, Grandmaster Chris, for, and Grandmaster Mustafa, and of, of course, for his uh, uh, all knowledge and experience that he have during all those years. Uh, for the presentation, it was clearly this time uh, very clearly, very easy to understand, and uh, that is the best. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you, Grandmaster. No questions. So thank you very you much, Grandmaster Chris. You're welcome. Was perfect and fantastic. As Grandmaster Chris and Grandmaster Mustafa mentioned, um, please double check your video, make sure everything is mm -hmm. correct. And uh, we are here to help you guys and we want to promote and support Taekwondo around the world. Uh, as you know, uh, we have got best international referee with us and uh, under guideline and support of the Grandmaster Mustafa, you know, all these people here to help to promote the globe and we will beat this uh, uh, COVID. So COVID cannot stop us and this is more important, bring uh, people who love Taekwondo and especially Pumse uh, together. Um, please uh, contact her directly, uh, me or Grandmaster Mustafa or Grandmaster Chris and all my international referees are available. So if anything is not uh, you're not sure about the rules of if you're reading or guideline, if anything is not very clear, still we have got time, you have got time uh, till 28th of um, July. Uh, Master Mustafa is a technical delegate. He will uh, select and randomize the compulsory concept for you guys. So, uh, and then we will publish it for you guys. Uh, from now, uh, later on, uh, 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 or the partner uh, Pumse channel will be published all the uh, new rules and regulation and uh, uh, translation of the or um, 
rules and regulation, please, if we if you are not sure, contact us. We have got plenty of people here. Uh, everybody speaks different language here. I've got Germany, Dutch, Spanish, Persian, so lots of language. So we are here and everybody must know the rules. And if you are not sure, please contact one of the international referees from your country and they will help you guys, definitely. This time we have got the international referee uh, master Suzuki from Japan. So, and uh, this is quite good now. We are getting um, from everywhere of the, around the world. Uh, as you know, guys, uh, our next competition is going to be in Korea, Korea Open, uh, Kyungi University. Same team will be with us. Grand Master Mustafa will be our technical delegate for that. And this is another opportunity for us to go to the other side of the world from the Toronto. We're going now to uh, Seoul. So that's quite nice to see the team working. Then every time I will ask advice from uh, my IR director, uh, technical delegate, uh, to give opportunity for the new referees. There is opportunity for you guys to be part of our amazing team and we will here to help you guys. So uh, this is team and one team, we need to work together and hopefully with the, your support or Punta grow everywhere in the world. So thank you very much. Uh, before I'm going to finish it, I will go back to my international referee. They can welcome you guys to the competition because competition still is open, still we are open. If you would like to join us, please, at the time, go to the martial arts events, join us. You can train and compete again as the best in the world. We got the, we got the best referee. Now we need the best player to come as well. So we are here waiting for you. So I was starting with my referees in no particular order, starting with Grandmaster Constantine. Thank you. Thank you, uh, everybody. Uh, thank you, Grandmata Mustafa, for your always uh, following us and updating us and making us uh, as a better referee and judges. Uh, thank you, uh, Grandmaster Chris, for your uh, contribution for the uh, competition. Uh, wish all the luck for the players and the coaches. Uh, please be aware of the uh, rules and regulation, as uh, Grandmaster Mustafa said. And uh, all the best for everybody. And this is, uh, I think it is the seventh or eighth uh, online uh, championship with uh, Master Cambys. He is very professional and his team also. Uh, this is a, a great opportunity to have uh, uh, the online Pumse because it's making no border. You can just contribute and participate to the championship any part in the world. Uh, that makes us a little bit more busy because we are working almost every weekend in a competition, but make us also more experienced. I want to take the opportunity to thanks all my referee colleagues to to the offer that they have they do to contribution of the Pumsi competition in the world. You are the best. We are a very good team under the leading of our grandmaster Mustafa. And yes, so wish you all of you good luck and have a nice weekend and see you this competition and the next competition and the next, next, next competition. Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you, Grandmaster. Thank you, Grandmaster. So I will go to next one to my friend, Master Peter. He can speak maybe in the, I know he can speak so many languages, but let's see what he, what he can speak. Um, let's try German because Constantine missed on it. Um, wie ihr heute alle gehört habt, ist es ganz wichtig, den Regeln zu folgen. Lest sie euch genau durch, folgt den Regeln, beachtet die Regeln. Wir müssen alle gleich behandeln, wir werden das auch tun. Die Bewertungen sind auf hohem Niveau, sind alle fair. Aber wir erwarten uns, dass ihr den Regeln folgt. 
Ähm, wir freuen uns auf ein wunderbares Turnier in Toronto und auch schon auf die nächsten Turniere. Es gibt in diesem Jahr noch weitere. Schaut einfach auf Marshall Events. Würde mich freuen, euch dort zu sehen. Dankeschön. Komm, Sam, wieder. Much, sir. And then I'll go to Spain. I'll go to Spain to where is Grand Master Pablo. Hello, good evening. I want to, to, to speak in Spanish, of course. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, buenas noches a todos. Uh, bienvenidos a este gran evento, Toronto Competition. Uh, tenéis un gran equipo de eh, árbitros internacionales, como han dicho mis, mis colegas, disfrutar, disfrutar del, del acontecimiento. Podéis seguir, como yo dije en un vídeo anterior, um, que os sirva de entrenamiento y de campeonato para futuros campeonatos, como es el Campeonato de Europa, el que ha nombrado eh, la organización eh, siguiente es de Corea. Eh, tenéis que disfrutar este tipo de campeonatos de una manera muy, muy, muy segura, a través de online. Y esta es una gran oportunidad, con grandes competidores, grandes árbitros, muy buena organización. Por lo tanto, disfrutar y mucha suerte para todos. Nos vemos. Thank you so much. Thank you, Grandmaster. So we're going now to Iran. We go to Iran to Grandmaster Hafez. So I think you need to speak Persian. Uh, Master Combis. Uh, believe me, you can speak better than me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure, yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Yeah, yeah. You can decide. Yeah. <laughs> you can speak English. I speak Farsi. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I, uh, I mean, you, you can speak Persian uh, better than me. I mean. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Okay. Also, uh, of course, of course, also uh, English language. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cob, try speak Farsi. Do you know, Aziz, that as Iran, we're in the most of 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 Master Mustafa, Master Chris, Master Constantine, as they had in the Dogaray and Omari Hassan, Kepo Mahasan, so better in Oya Harchi Shari Bomohasan, Omigoran Ke, Hanus Bakas, I got to switch to Washing, the Mustafa Mahina, where more for Shalom Shinche, as a relation of Washing. Mami. Okay, sir, now I'm going to go to Sweden. Where is Sweden? Master Laban. Master Laban. Technical error. Master Laban, can you hear me? I think there is a technical error with Master Laban. So we go to we go to Austria to Grandmaster Johanna. Sincerely, thank you so much. That's great. Master Kambis? Yes, yes. Can you hear me? Yes. I yes. can hear you, but before you was frozen. Oh, is it? Something <laughs> yeah. was wrong. <laughs> I think technical, technical. This is the beauty of the live, you know. So sometimes the network, you know. <laughs> but now we're back again. We're back. So okay. we're back now. We are with you now. Okay. okay. Now we are hearing you. Thank you, Grandmaster Chris and Grandmaster Mustafa, for the excellent explanation. I think everything is well prepared, and I wish. All competitors, good luck. Thank you. Thank you, Ramasa. And then we're going to Pumsi channel. We have got with us Carolina. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Uh, yo también uh, voy a hablar en español como Maestro Pablo. Eh, simplemente comentarles, como decía Maestro Pablo, que disfruten eh, la competencia. 
que aprovechen estas oportunidades para prepararse, por ejemplo, para el europeo, o si todo sale bien y tenemos mundial el próximo año, eh, es una competencia que está súper bien organizada por un team que ya lleva casi dos años trabajando y está muy bien cohesionado, la organización es estupenda, eh, Master Canvas hace, ha hecho un trabajo bastante importante en lo que es las competencias online, eh, todos los árbitros tienen muchísima experiencia y está todo perfecto. Lo único que ustedes tienen que hacer es grabar sus vídeos y disfrutar eh, de esto y poder toparse con competidores bastante importantes. Con respecto a lo que eh, eh, nos introdujo Grandmaster eh, Chris acerca de... de de las regulaciones de esta competencia, solo comentarles que está la versión de este documento en, en español, eh, la voy a subir a Pumse Channel y también eh, eh, Grand Ma eh, Grand, eh, Master Canvas lo, lo subirá también en sus redes sociales. Agradecer a Grand, Ma eh, Grand Master eh, Chris y a Grand Master Mustafa y a todos los... Eh, eh, competidores que van a estar con nosotros y a todos mis colegas eh, árbitros eh, y, y los árbitros internacionales. Muchas gracias, Cam Samida. Gracias, I know gracias, thank you. <laughs> I'm learning. <laughs> okay, I think I'm going to back to Sweden. If Sweden, can you hear us? I think so. Oh yes, thank you, thank you. Bienvenue, welcome. Welcome. Bienvenidos. Eh, aquí otra vez en español también. Vendrá el sueco también. Eh, mucha suerte. Disfrutar. Eh, tenéis un equipo de árbitros y organización que no os va a defraudar. Esto es una gran oportunidad para manteneros en forma. Eh, welcome to our competition. Eh, We are a good team. We have been working together, as Carolina said, uh, nearly two years uh, online. So you're in good hands and uh, the best is going to win. And we are fair and we are very experienced. So very welcome. And now, på svenska, ni är väldigt välkomna till vår tävling. Ni känner oss sedan innan. Vi är ett väldigt sammanslutet team och uh, alltid den bästa kommer vinna. Welcome to our competition in Toronto and don't forget to come to Korea in uh, it's in August? No, it's in September. 3 to 5th of September. Yes. Uh, uh, yes. Can be senses. Okay, welcome and good luck. Best will win. Thank you very much. So before we go and finish, now I'm going to go to the for final word from Grand Master uh, Mustafa, and then we go to Grand Master Chris, and hopefully everybody can have rest. So Grand Master Mustafa. Grand Master Mustafa, you have. To... You, you're in mute, Master Mustafa. Okay. No, can you hear me now? Yes. Yes. Master. yes. Oh, I'm very sorry. Okay, um, now, uh, actually, all the colleagues have already said uh, good words, and um, now, uh, I would say to everybody, uh, yeah, good luck, and the best uh, will win, and uh, once again, please, uh, uh, all the athletes, coaches, please check your, your uh, video before you send, and uh, yeah, uh, so you are in good hands. They are good referees, uh, experienced referees, and also uh, also also the, the good organization, uh, Master Ali Kambis, and uh, everybody's good hands. So I wish uh, good luck, stay safe, and health. Come uh, uh, Grandmaster Kambis, um, yes, can, I, can I add a few words in French and Arabic, please? Fantastic. Mashallah. Uh, <laughs> uh, Allez-y. Uh, mesdames et messieurs, vous êtes les bienvenus à Toronto Open uh, 2021. Uh, S'il vous plaît, lisez très bien les règlements. Et il y a pas mal de compétiteurs de la France qui participent ici. Uh, vous êtes les bienvenus. Uh, 
euh, tout le team des arbitres sont international, euh, plein de succès à tout le monde et voici, vous êtes les bienvenus. Il y a des gens qui ont été en Arabie, à la fin de Toronto Open 2021. Il y a des gens qui ont été en train de se faire en في المباريات في البومسة حظوظا موفقة إلى الجميع وأتمنى لكم مباريات ممتعة نحن في هذه المباريات تحت إشراف رئيس الاتحاد العالمي للبومسة الجراند ماستر مصطفى الذي هو عنده خبرة كبيرة في هذا المجال أهلا وسهلا بكم والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله شكرا Shukran. Shukran. <laughs> Mashallah. Thank you, thank you. Uh, now we go to our IR director, Grandmaster Chris, for the final. Grandmaster Chris. Yes, hello, good evening. Uh, thank you, everybody, for the contribution to this uh, video. I think it was a very um, inspiring session. Um, I'm going to say something in Dutch. Yes. So, um, Welkom iedereen op het uh, Toronto Range Online 2021 toernooi. Um, er zijn nog altijd plaatsen, jullie kunnen nog inschrijven. Wij kunnen terugvallen op een aantal zeer ervaren scheidsrechters en ook technisch proberen wij ons iedere keer te verbeteren. De laatste keer hebben we nog een klein beetje online problemen gehad. Ook dit gaan we nu proberen op te lossen en um, we kunnen alleen maar beter worden met te doen. Ik hoop in ieder geval dat jullie erbij zijn. Ik hoop ook, ook dat jullie er dan ook in begin september zullen bij zijn, want dan hebben we weer een nieuw toernooi, maar dat gaat dan door, zogezegd, in Korea. Dus toch weer andere mensen, andere deelnemers waarschijnlijk. Toch weer een, een extra uitdaging. In ieder geval, dank u wel om uh, deze sessie te volgen. Nog even herhalen, alstublieft, volg de regels en check uw video's. Het is zonde dat wij iemand moeten disqualificeren omdat er iets misloopt met de video of dat er iets niet wordt gevolgd. Dat is echt jammer van de moeite. Dank u wel. So thank you everybody and I wish you all a wonderful evening and a nice weekend. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.